Today we're talking about the three biggest and most common mistakes that people make when they begin investing. Welcome to Don't Fear Finance. The three biggest mistakes that people make when they invest are not understanding their investment, failing to diversify, and letting their emotions dictate whether they do something in the markets or not. Don't worry if you do these because after we explain what they are, we'll describe how you can prevent it from happening in the future. If you don't get these mistakes under control, then you can lose a lot of money even if you haven't lost any yet. Before we continue, make sure to like and subscribe with all notifications on if you enjoyed and comment down below what you want to see in the next video. Never, and I say never, invest in something you don't understand. The world's most successful investor, Warren Buffett, has warned people that not understanding either the business model or the industry that you're investing in could lead to unexpected losses. This won't happen because you're impacting the business or something, but because you don't understand how the business looks, how the business model actually is, and what happens in certain periods of the year. This is something you should definitely watch out for if you're investing heavily in the stock market. I'm not saying that this is not going to happen in other types of investments such as bonds or real estate, but it's definitely something that you need to watch out for. Warren Buffett suggests that you should study what you're going to invest in. He says that this is something that will give you the best chances of finding out the best company for you. One last word from Mr. Buffett is that he says that it only takes one or two good investments to make a fortune. So learning about what you're investing in is going to give you an advantage above other investors. If you don't want to study what you're interested in investing in, then that's okay. Your best fit for buying an index fund that holds what you're interested in investing in. Bottom line, never invest in something you don't understand. Failing to diversify. This is what could cause your portfolio to either lose a lot of value or gain a lot of value. We never know if a stock, property, or bond is going to be profitable and by putting everything into one specific place, you could risk a lot of money. If you have invested 90% of your investing money into the tech industry, then you would be at a lot of risk if people stop buying buying tech from this industry or business. The value of those businesses would go down, meaning that you would lose a lot of money alongside it. If you invested in the finance industry as well, then that would be a different story. You would have lost money, but you would have still had money in other industries keeping the value of your portfolio up. People lose a lot of money because they don't have many investments making the money safely. There are many other options than trying to put money into individual stocks to diversify. There are index funds for almost every investment. There's the S&P 500 for stocks, REITs for real estate, and many more that you can choose from. You don't have to study the stock market for hours on end or search for properties on Craigslist, but you do need to understand that you can't just stick with one investment. Third, do not let your emotions dictate whether you're going to do something or not in the markets. This is what kills people's profits, gains, and wealth in the markets. We see so many people come to a drop in the markets and get all freaked out and sell, or people see that an investment is doing extremely well and hold on to it. What they don't see, however, is the recession coming up of a global pandemic. The wave they were riding on then crashes and they lose everything. That is not because of unfortunate luck. They could have hopped off that trend if they didn't let their emotion of greed take control of the reins. You see this with many investments. People who invested in Bitcoin in 2010 probably saw many ups and downs. If they let their emotion of fear take control and sell when the value went down, then they would have lost a lot of money. When people don't think logically about things, especially when it comes to investing, they don't see the long-term picture. They only see the $100,000 loss. Again, there are ways to prevent this from happening, which is investing in long-term index funds for whatever investment that you're planning on putting your money in. So let's recap. The first biggest mistake is investing in things that you don't understand. Doing this will result in you either not knowing when to get out or invest more. Number two is not diversifying. Investing in one thing is very dangerous because if it does poorly, then you'll lose a lot of money. Putting your money in more places is how you prevent yourself from losing all of your money or a large portion of it. We are not perfect. It is okay to mess up, but we do have to have a backup plan in case that happens. Third is not letting your emotions take control. If you know there is some good potential in a certain investment, but you see ups and downs, you could let your emotions of fear take control. People lose a lot of money, not just from stupid investing, but from letting their emotions get in the way. Thanks for watching. Knowing these three big mistakes about investing and growing your wealth is a very good thing because you have less setbacks to make large sums of money. Like and subscribe with all notifications if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video.